Hey, you're listening to Marketing Out Loud, a daily podcast where I share advice, stories, and insights to help you build a thriving consulting or professional services practice. To subscribe to the show, head over to marketingoutloud.fm. I just posted a video on LinkedIn about fear. And you may have already heard this because it may have come out on the podcast before this, may have come out after this. I'm not entirely sure on the timing. That's up to my man, Brian. But if you didn't hear it, the video is about how we're all afraid in the end. You, me, everybody, we're all afraid of the unknown. The difference between the folks who win and the folks who don't is winners see opportunity on the other side of fear and they run towards it. Whereas I don't like using the term losers, but you know, losers in, in a soft, gentle way are the ones who see the fear and run away from it. And I posted that video and almost immediately I got a comment from a client. If you're listening, thank you for the comment, Darlin. And the comment said, this is quite a coincidence. because Just before you posted this, I was thinking about... What if I record a webinar and spend all the time and effort doing that and then nobody watches it? Nobody signs up for it. And Arlen's somebody who's just recently joined my coaching program. And it's a great, it's a great comment because I think that's a fear that we all have is what if we do all this work? What if we do all this activity? What if we pour in all this time and energy into this thing, this process, whatever that process is, and we don't get the results. And I think that fear prevents a lot of people from doing anything, prevents them from even trying. It prevents them from taking any meaningful steps forward. And as a result, they stay stuck exactly where they are. But the thing I want you to understand and the thing that I I try to impress upon my clients as much as possible is marketing is a grind. That's the harsh truth. And I don't want to I don't want to sugarcoat it for you. I don't want to mince words. Marketing is a grind. If you think you can show up and just do a couple of really smart things and all of a sudden everything changes, sorry, you're in for a world of disappointment. It is a grind. The videos you record, the content you produce, the emails you write, the webinar you record, they may not work the first, second, third, fourth, fifth time. That's not how it works. It may completely fall flat on its face. It may completely miss the mark. People might not respond the way that you'd hope. You've got to be open to that. And you've got to, like I've talked about recently on this show, fall in love with the process. The process, if you stick to it and you put in the time and you divorce yourself from the outcome, at least in the immediate, the process is what drives results. So the harsh truth, but the truth that winners know and realize is that this is a grind. And if that scares you, well, you've got two options. You can run away from it abandon the process, don't do anything, and find a way to be comfortable and content with where you are. That's my best advice to you. Or you can lean into it, you can face the fear, you can acknowledge that this is a process, it's a grind, it's hard work, and if you stick to the process and you do the work and you put in the time, it'll work for you eventually. When that is depends on your commitment to the process, your ability to execute the process, and the nature of your market. But it will work. So good news for those of us who are willing to put in the time and see it through. Hey, thanks for listening. Do me a favor. If you like what you hear, go on iTunes and leave us a rating and a review because it helps more people discover the show. Thanks so much. 